And welcome back to Let's Play Silent Storm with Polo Dash. Uh, last time our squad here uh, raided this warehouse facility in search for some secret uh, documents or information pertaining to um, experimental rocket fuel that the uh, British has been doing research on. I think one of our secret agents, I think it was Stevens, pointed it pointed us in this direction, saying that the, uh, the experimental fuel was stored in this facility somewhere. But what we found instead was this yellow eye. We have um, some secret documents to uh, pick up and read, which uh, we will do. And then um, I think after that we have a ton of looting to do. Um, I, think there, I think there's a box or treasure chest and every building of this map, along with all the crap that uh, all these losers dropped that try to stop us from doing our mission, and totally failed an epic Hollywood shootout style, <laughs> with guys falling off guard towers here, and guys head smashing through windows and stuff, and us punching holes in walls, it was, it was pretty awesome. Okay, but enough of that. Um, I think, yeah, Holly can go and, uh, well, let's leave combat first. I guess you can go and pick up these documents here and we can read it. Yay! No investigation clue. Let's see what we get. Alright, secret. Uh, addressed to, uh, Sergeant Harris. Military warehouse number 51. Report number stuff. Uh, Commander Bradshaw, Supply HQ. Uh, theft of list of dangerous materials. If someone stole a list of dangerous materials, why not steal the dangerous materials? That's more fun. At some point yesterday, the uh, inventory list of high-value dangerous materials stored in our warehouse disappeared. Oh, that's a, that's a shame. Local security and intelligence forces have been advised. Hopefully not Rex Willer. <laughs> they are currently investigating a, a Mr. Weber, a gentleman living in a nearby town. And we talked to Weber, but he didn't really mention anything about... Rock repellent. What the hell did he mention? Uh, he was, uh, yeah, he was the guy, the, 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 um, the joint task force between the British and the Russians. Nothing to do with this. Uh, apparently he is someone they have had under investigation for some time. I will let you know further information become. well, I will let you know when further information becomes available. Uh, Sergeant Harris. Oh, so Sergeant Harris wrote this, and it's addressed to Commander Bresh. Oh, so this was... He was writing this, and he was about to ship it? I don't know, who cares. Okay. Uh, what did that tell us? That told so us... Yeah, exactly, so what? Who cares? Where do we go next to kill? That's what Claus was thinking. Um... Yeah, I don't think... That, that didn't really tell us anything about Secret Propellant, except for the fact that, uh... Okay, the secret propellant to make them requires dangerous materials. Whoa! <laughs> oh, thank you, document of obviousness. Uh, but, uh, let's see, what is interesting? Um, well, Weber, maybe Weber was uh, investigating this rock repellent on the side, maybe. Um, but I guess he wasn't really in touch. He didn't keep in touch with, uh, our, uh, I don't know, Super Spy Stevens. I, I, I guess they don't have the, the gadgets in the 40s that Super Spies are usually equipped with to keep in touch with each other. It's a shame. Because, you know, if, if Stevens knew that Weber was investigating all this, he wouldn't have to have, you know, Weber could, or if Weber knew Stevens was investigating what the hell am I trying to say? Well, either way, one of the, one of them could have saved us time by telling us about both of what they were doing. Uh, hold on, I'm kind of looking around here to see where I need to loot. I just need to loot everywhere. I guess I'll just just take the whole squad and just walk them, take, give them a tour around and have them unlock stuff and open boxes. What's this guy doing here? <laughs> yeah, you know, these, these civilians are funny sometimes, like... I, I think uh, some of the civilian, civilians have, like, different AI, like, some AI is just said to be real civilians and run around scared, and other civilians are, like, spy civilians or something, that are just supposed to hug 
our PCs. Like here with claws. It's like, look, it's a sniper! You wanna trade hats? Your hats is cool. I don't know. Okay. Anyway. Uh, let's get the squad. Oh. I suppose y'all can reload. And let's start with move this house in front of us. We'll take Holly. And I be on it. Almost, almost space. Don't let me forget to pick up sugar cans. I'm always afraid to do that. Holly, what do you think of this treasure box? Nothing? Okay. Go. Wire cutters. Cool. And mines. And this stuff. This is the stuff that's never... Medicine school required 110. Is this stuff even worth picking up? Um, oh, fuck it, you know, why not? Uh, but where is uh, Gary? Gary can hold on to this crap. There we go. Gary, what are you doing? Come on. No, no, man, get up, dude. <laughs> I like it here. I'm just gonna lie here forever. Pick up, pick up this stuff. Thank you. Okay. You know what? I, I really did like how the, uh, the mission turned up, that turned up, actually. I mean, the first half was kind of eh, with the, with the sneaking around those three buildings. I had fun, but I'm not sure if it was, <laughs> if it was fun for you people. But once, once the, uh, the attack started, it was pretty awesome. Uh... And you know, like, if I'm gonna say uh, another thing that I like about this game, well, actually, you know, I be on it. Maybe uh, not just this game, but any game that does does this or plays like this, where uh, the AI is unpredictable, and um, sets you up like I don't know what the hell I'm trying to say. Like, it kind of felt like I was directing a movie right here in this scene, you know. And I, I really liked how the AI's randomness really played out uh, in such a way that things turned up really cool. There you go. Now uh, I am even more dangerous. Okay, it's more Lincoln Logs, the M98s. I be willing. Um, do this to save space. What is this? Okay. Chatting it up with, uh, Fritz there. Nice machine gun you got there. <laughs> Looking down, you know. Anyway, um, I get right on it! Uh, what else can I say? Order confirmed! Anyway, I guess we could- oh, you know what? I'll like, pick up one of these, uh, Magazine, yeah, just one's good. Alright. Oh, it's a M1917 scope Springfield. Oh, I think Claus wants it. Alright, I'll let Claus take it. Oh, it's only up there, never mind, fuck it. No, you're not going up there. Uh, let's check out here, here next. I be willing. Is it possible that I was meant to be so that? Still chatting it up with the lady over there. <laughs> I am young. I have much to learn. Sure thing. What do you think, Holly? Safe? Uh, as she's looking at it. I think everybody else is gonna step out, seeing that the seeing all the red bangles. Yeah. Okay. Oh, okay, Gary. Here's like me next. I get to talk to the nice lady. Open. All right. Call Reggie over. Me experience be paying off. Minutes. Oh, there's those giant mushroom kinds. Yeah, we got more of these. Awesome. Let's see if I 
this guys. Notice improvement. <laughs> okay, Gary. Now that Fritz is away, because it's improvement, you could. I don't know. Sway that woman there. With everybody gone. Oh, it's locked. Read you loud and clear. Lock picks up. So we got here. Ooh. How's the Russian rifle doing in here? It's an SVT forty. Um <laughs> You know uh, if I have uh, if I have viewers right now that, that's knowledgeable about this game, they're probably screaming at the screen, grab it, grab it, or I will troll you for life. You didn't grab the Garand. Then grab all the other awesome weapons that the allies use. At least grab this, or I will, I swear to you, I will troll you until your eyes and your nose bleed. I will pick it up for you people. Uh, but you know, uh, you know, I, I, I can say I picked it up for, I don't know, maybe as evidence or as a clue. Because it is a Russian weapon, and it's sitting here in a British warehouse. What's it doing here? You know, maybe it could play, yeah, you know. Maybe Weber was investigating that, that that joint task force thing, and this is part of it. That he, yeah, he probably thought that yeah, that, that's fishy. Investigating this warehouse, finding uh, Russian weapons amongst the uh, British forces, and a nice shiny Colt M1911. We'll just leave that. We got plenty of those. So I can take that back to HQ and say, look what we found. We got find Russian weapons. All right. Next is that warehouse. There we. Are. I guess you can sit there. You can read you loud and clear. Look, look badass with your pistol all out like that. It's my Luger. I shoot people with it. I totally shot that officer in the face back there. It was awesome. Order confirmed. That was my husband. <laughs> well, you know, 